Hey people, how you doing? I'm back with another pod review. This time, a chocolate maruga. And this was sent to me uh, by grower and YouTuber Jim Johnson. You can find him here on YouTube as Planko Dude. Uh, I will link to him in the description. Um, and the origins of this, uh, at least at the time of this review, uh, are to me a little bit murky. Uh, I know Jim got his plant uh, that this pod get, comes off of uh, from a guy in Georgia off of the THP, the hot pepper forums. Um, now the origin of the chocolate maruga itself, um, that's a bit of a mystery to me uh, as there's the chocolate maruga and the brown maruga. Some people say they're the same pepper, some people say they're not. Um, now I had a brown maruga late last year, uh, and though it had been flooring reviewers for a while, it didn't exactly knock my socks off. Um, this looks quite a bit meaner. Uh, in fact, it looks very little like a maruga at all. In fact, it looks more like a giant dougla, um, and that scares me a little. Um, the walls here feel quite thin, uh, and I've had this for a little while, so it's starting to get soft. I have to just get to this review. So I'm not going to waste any time. I'm just going to pop the stem off. It's got a strong aroma. I'm going to go ahead and cut this mean bad boy open. After I post this, uh, feel free, anyone who has any additional information about this chili, the chocolate maruga versus the brown maruga. Feel free to sound off in the comments. Uh, I usually reply pretty quickly. So, uh, you have any in additional information that I don't, uh, feel free to provide it. Uh, it'd be a service to everyone. But here we go, slicing this boy open here. That's a pretty massive pod. So I am a bit nervous. Ugh. All right. It's oily, oily, oily. And uh, yeah, it smells like Dougla, actually. Oh, and I do not like seeing this. This is not cool. Where do you see this, guys? It is really just nasty, nasty wet in there. Let's see if I can give you guys a closer look. This will focus properly. You can see. Here we see a trait common to brown or chocolate super hots, where the placental tissue is a, a dark reddish brown. Um, and there's definitely a lot of placenta in there. Uh, placental tissue is completely lining the wall of the chili. Um, and it is big. Now, I don't know exactly how thick this placenta is. I don't think much. Uh, the walls are very thin on this. Um, but I'm not going to mess around with this any longer. I'm going to eat it for pain, for science, for glory. Very sweet. immediately hot on the tongue.
Okay. Despite um, them looking and smelling a lot like Dougla, tastes nothing like one. It's very sweet. Not too much earthiness there. Not really get, getting much prettiness either. And um, the throat burn is relatively mild. Um, this is all tongue burn. Tongue burn on this one is vicious. Feels like I stuck my tongue into smoking hot frying oil. Now the throat's starting to ramp up. Tongue feels swollen. There is some throat heat, pretty much concentrated right around here. And uh, I'm going to take a swig of water here. Let's get this out of my teeth. But yeah. It's mostly just a full-on mouth burn. Um, roof of the mouth, tip of the tongue, gums. Making me tear up a bit. Sorry about that. No, it's gross. Starting to move to the chest. This might be a little bit of a gut bomb. I don't like those. Don't like them one bit. But it's already starting to fade the mouth and the throat. I think it peaked about 20 seconds ago. I'm not getting any floral aftertaste, which is good. just a, a sweetness and an earthiness. It doesn't really have much fruity flavor. It's a good flavor. Um, 
actually probably one of the uh, better tasted chocolates I've had. For flavor, I'm going to give that 8 out of 10. On heat, um, that's definitely up there. That's a really aggressive, full-on mouth burn. Um, attacks the tongue brutally. Uh, roof of the mouth, gums, cheeks. Throat burn's not too terrifying, though. Um, but it's definitely hot enough to earn it in 8 out of 10 on heat as well. That's a good pepper. Um, I want to thank Jim Johnson once again for sending me that pod to review. Really awesome pod, brother. Uh, you're doing a bang up job with the grow. Uh, wherever that came from, if anybody has any more information about that chili, feel free to share it in the comments. And uh, that's going to do it for this review, guys. Uh, please like, comment, share with your friends, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Later.